At the Naval Diving and Salvage Center at Naval Support Activity, Panama City has a new commander on deck. Incoming Commander Hung Cal relieves Commander Michael Egan. News 13's Corey DeBridnia attended today's ceremony on the base. Corey, Commander Cal's journey to this new position is quite remarkable. It is, Jerry. It's the American dream, and believe it or not, his journey started in Saigon, Vietnam, and ends right here in Panama City. For many serving in the United States Navy, Parade the colors. Only a small percentage make it here. Commander Hung Cal, United States Navy, prospective commanding officer, naval diving and salvage training. To be a commanding officer is, is really the pinnacle, and that's what we all strive to be. Commander Hung Cal takes over as the commanding officer of the Naval Diving and Salvage Training Center, but his journey tells the story maybe even more so than the medals on his uniform. States, actually, I was a Vietnamese refugee. We came over here in 1975. We were, we left Vietnam 14 hours before the end. This country gave us uh, purpose, it gave us education, and it gave, but really citizenship, you know, uh, being part of something great. Commander Cao has had anything but a traditional run at the position that overlooks maybe the most elite special operations and dive training in the world. Who ya in the SDC? Who ya in the SDC? He takes over that position from Commander Michael Egan. When we talked earlier about you know what it takes to, to become a commanding officer, it's a lot of your peers who pull you up along the way, and and that's he's one of my peers and one of my close friends that that has pulled me along the way um, over the years. As sequestration and other obstacles face commanders in terms of downsizing, that won't be a concern for Cal in the same way. In fact, if anything, we will be augmented more because that, a lot of admissions in the world is going to be focused around special operations and, and diving. Our, our concern is really how it's going to happen when we have to expand even more. And as his wife pins on his new rank, they begin their lives in Panama City. A second go around for Cal, who he himself went through dive school and naval support activity Panama City. It's just nice to be back in the South and, and to, to be embraced by the community and just to, for people to greet you and say hi. That's, uh, that's a big difference for us. Who are in the SEC? And if that's not impressive enough, Commander Cao is fluent in both French and Vietnamese and is the subject matter expert for the Navy's biometrics program.